I'm going to play a game of solitaire for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. If you're new to the game, there's a link below the video to a lesson playlist and the rules. For this particular game, I want to try something a little different. I want to play two hands in the same category for one player, and for the other, two hands from different categories and compare results. All my tiles have been mixed and built into walls next to the risers. This way we can keep track of the progress of the game based on how many tiles are left for picking. I'm going to deal the tiles now. Player 1 will get 28 tiles and player 2 will get 27. Then we'll look at the hands and analyze each and decide where the strengths lie and which categories we'll be playing. Let's identify where the strengths are here. We have a pair of flowers, all the dragons. Here we have a pair of ones, a pair of sixes, and a pair of fours. I think we could do two, four, six, eight. So let's see about two, four, six, eight. for one, maybe even play two, four, six, eight for both hands. We'd probably, we would only have to get rid of a pair of east and west. So we'd have, let's just say one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve discards. But that would include a pair of joker bait here. Okay, so let's just wait and see. Let's look and see what we can do for player two and then make a decision. Okay, now here we have news with a pair there. Pair of threes, pair of eight, pair of nine, pair of nine, seven, eight, nine, seven, eight, nine. Okay, let's do this. Let's play two completely different categories here, and let's play all two, four, six, eight here. See what happens. So we're going to do winds and dragons and seven, eight, nine, maybe even the nine, nine, eight pair hand. We have threes, north and south with threes, maybe. Threes with north and south, or news with dragons, or news concealed. I think I would start by discarding these down here. Here I would try for the, maybe the 998 pair hand, or 8989 eight, concealed pungs the last hand under concealed for a consecutive run so here we're going to get rid of the east and the west of course we'll keep the flowers and we'll play 2468 joker bait So let's just test out this theory. Let's gather every 2468 that we can until we run out of discards. We'll hold this for joker bait. If I had to pick a hand, 
I probably would play maybe the two, four, six, eight pair hand here. And then maybe two, four, six, eight, two, four, six, eight dragons. It's the third hand down under two, four, six, eight. We have a joker we could use for the eight. So let's just see what happens. So north and south with threes or news with dragons, nine, nine, eight pair hand or seven or eight, nine, eight, nine concealed pung hand. Then here, all two, four, six, eight joker bait discards. So that's going to be 10 discards and joker bait. Lots of discards here. So let's test the theory. So I'm going to start by discarding the south. And then I'm going to move this just a little bit. There. I'm not sure if you could have seen all that. Okay. So we discarded a south. We're going to draw for this player. Let's just count tiles just to make sure that we have the right number. Four, 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 three. Okay, looking good. As far as tile count, not really looking so good, at least for this player. This is going to be a real underdog. We're going to draw. Okay, one bam. That's not helpful. I'm going to discard it. One bam. And now we're going to, oh, I'll use this to mark whose turn it is. So we're going to draw for player one. There's a seven. Well, can you use that maybe as joker bait? Let's get rid of the east. And draw up here. This is concealed. Red. Let's get rid of the two bam. Drawing down here. This is concealed. Five. Let's get rid of the three crack and draw up here. Five crack. We could use that maybe for joker bait. Five, six, five. I don't think that's going to be helpful. Let's get rid of the six. Six crack. And we'll draw down here. Nine crack. Oh no. Okay, nine crack up here. This is concealed. Okay, seven bam. That's a keeper, maybe. Let's get rid of the five dot. One, two, three, four, four. Okay, down here. There's a six. We're going to keep it. We'll keep every two, four, six, eight. Let's keep it all. This is joker bait. We're going to get rid of the one bam. We just are going to gather two, four, six, eight, joker bait. Drawing up here. Three crack. Oh, that's a keeper. Look, three crack. Maybe we could play a quint up there. North, three, dragon. Let's get rid of the five crack. And draw. Five bam. That's not helpful. Let's get rid of this one dot and draw. Joker, keeper, get rid of the five. Let's draw down here. There's a two. That's even. We're going to keep it. Okay, let's get rid of that five dot. So we're keeping all two, four, six, eight. Eventually, a strong pattern should emerge. We'll just keep going. Drawing a west. Now we have news here. Oh, okay. News. Two pair. Threes. Eight, nine, eight, nine. Maybe we should get rid of the sevens. If we get sixes, we could switch to three, six, nine.
okay this is nine I was thinking if we did the nine the nine eight the nine nine eight pair hand we have no representation there for the nine nine eight in dots let's get rid of the seven dot it's looking rough for both of these players three bam there's some joker bait let's get rid of the nine dot up here green okay there's a pair i think we should go ahead and play a quint up here leverage these multiples north west green three joker bait singles eight nine eight nine concealed pung hand so let's get rid of the south down here joker that's helpful let's get rid of the five bam six i don't think that's going to be helpful but let's get rid of this east four we got a four okay let's get rid of the nine bam this is concealed one dot player one we got a two okay look at all the two four six eight we've got here we're just going to keep gathering seven bam we're kind of getting to a place where we might be able to make a hand two four six eight two four six concealed with dragons use this as the eight that might work let's just wait and see we still have discards so seven bam was discarded this is concealed we're going to draw two crack let's discard not ready here i mean we could use these jokers and do two four but we have no other six eight i would not take it that was the last tile in the second wall we're going into the third wall middle game everybody should know what category they're in and in this case we are good we've got two four six eight for both hands here consecutive run and winds and dragons north okay north up here let's quint quint we don't need these now let's throw the west we don't need these either okay so we're going to draw now there's an eight two four six eight okay so here one seven three none of them are out let's go ahead and let's discard the seven crack it really doesn't matter because we're gathering evens up here one dot oh i could have probably gotten rid of that west doesn't really matter though i suppose oh look at that two two four six eight we're going to keep gathering let's discard that seven crack you really don't have to pick a hand until you run out of discards or until a discard goes down that you can claim while still having potential with the rest of your tiles so let's just keep seeing what happens as we go we discarded the seven crack so it's this player's turn five dot let's go ahead and get rid of that west should have thrown that keep tile number tiles are more likely to show up with a joker and an exposure let's draw now for player one okay joker that's nice all right let's get rid of three bam and now we're going to draw up here eight dot eight dot eight nine seven eight oh and now the eight shows up after we got rid of that seven let's keep it and get rid of the well we could still have options with our dragon actually let's keep the dragons and get rid of the six bam 
now we have to make a choice here. We have twos, four, six, no eight. We could do two, four, six, eight, and take it with a joker, but we would have no eight for the other part of that hand. The hand I'm thinking of is the sec uh, second from the bottom, Pung, Pung, Kong, and then there's a missing one. I think that there's probably a better choice here. So let's say if we do maybe the pear hand down here. Let's see here. Two, four, six, eight. If we did two, four, two, four, six, eight. We're missing eights. That's the challenge here. We are missing eights, but we could make that two, four, six, eight work really with this pair hand. We just need to pair up here. Then what we would have left is maybe two, four, six, eight, dragon. That's pretty light though. Or two, four, six, eight, dragon. So this would be our eight right here. Okay. I still would not take that six. Let's draw. So let's see, four, 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 three. So I think it's this player's turn to pick. There's four. This pair hand is coming in. Let's discard the three bam. Drawing up here. There's a white. Now we have a choice. Let's get rid of the five dot. Drawing down here. Five bam. Oops. Okay, drawing up here. Seven dot. Let's get rid of the three dot. We need evens. There's an eight. Finally, we got an eight. Okay, now two, four, six, eight. Let's just check it out. Let's throw the one crack. Okay, and it will be this player's turn, but let's just check it out. So let's put everything in order. Look at that. Two, four, six, eight, two, four, six, eight, two, four, six. So we need to utilize these to create two hands. We could do two, four, six, eight. Let's see, two, four, six, eight. Trying to make that pair hand work here. Two, four, six, eight. We're kind of equal. Two, four, six, eight, and then two, four, six, eight, and then use either sixes or fours for the pairs down here. Two, four, six, eight, and then use these in here. Oh, see the challenge here is we need either the four here or the six here. So this battle is what I'm trying to test. Is the battle helpful or is it more helpful to have all those tiles to work with? It feels a little bit combative. Let's keep going though. Let's draw. Three band, that's a discard. This player's not having any trouble. Let's draw. There's a two. Okay, two, four, Six, eight, two, four, six, eight. With twos, we put these down here with these, these up here, and these down here. This hand is ready to win on a six crack pair hand. Down here, we need to recover now. 
So this will be the challenge because all our 2, 4, 6, 8 are up here. So down here, we're going to need to play something with pung, with pungs and kongs, no pairs, maybe. Because we've got all our pairs up here. 2, 4, 6, 8, dragon. So... Uh, see, we need, we have a gap. We have no two and we have no, we have a four there. But if we go two, four, six, eight, dragon, we would be throwing away the pairs. So there's no two dot out. There's no eight dot out. Nope, we have an eight. Nope, we need an eight bam. Okay, well, let's just keep going. The other option would be maybe uh, two, four, six, eight with the green dragon. We can use jokers for some of that. Okay, let's see what happens there. So we have four, 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 four. We need to discard. Okay, so we need a six crack to win. Let's throw the one crack. So they're gonna make it maybe with this pair hand here. It's the second hand that's the problem at the moment. Let's draw up here. Nine dot. Let's discard the three dot. Okay, this is interesting. There's one nine dot out, and I think, I don't know, did we throw that? Nine, eight, seven, nine, eight, seven, nine, eight. They could make that nine, nine, eight pair hand work. Let me just put it in order. For some reason, they decided to make it backwards. 9, 8, 9, 8, 7, 9, 8, 7. This one is stronger because it's already paired up. So we need an 8 bam and a 7 crack and then of course the 9 dot. I think we could maybe get rid of that flower next. So there's 5, 6, 7, 8. So that's 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 3. Okay, this player's turn. One crack. Up here, five bam. Four dot. If we can get a two dot, we could play two, four, six, eight, dragon. And we would need the red dragon for this. We have to decide, we have four and five or because we could also play two, four, six, eight, white, concealed. I think that might be better. And then we would just use these for the twos that are up there. Two, four, six, eight, white. There are no white dragons out. So if we did two, four, six, eight, let's go ahead and give up the two bam. And then next we can give up the four bam. All right, we're gonna draw, let's see, four, 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 three. Okay, we're good to go here, up here. Green dragon, okay. There's their tile there. So this can go over there. Nine, eight, seven. Let's get rid of the seven dot. Did I mess this up somewhere? No, because I, I have an exposure there. Okay, seven dot was discarded. We're gonna draw here. Six dot, two, four, six, eight, white. I think that was a good choice there. Let's get rid of this four bam. And then let's draw up here. That quickly came together actually, but I think because of the jokers, let's draw red. Wow, look at all those dragons. Let's get rid of this flower down here. One dot. Four crack. We need a six crack. Exchange, please. Thank you.
Okay. Two, two, four, six, eight, dragon. This is the weakness at the moment. Let's get rid of the green dragon because we could still do, no, we can't do the two, four. We have no two. All right, green dragon, and we're gonna pung, or kong. We're gonna kong it. They're ready on a quint. Let's get rid of the red dragon. Doesn't really matter. Down here. White, oh my gosh, they got it, wow. Let's throw the red. Oh my goodness, that is amazing. Let's draw four dot. This is concealed, they don't even need it. The concealed hand convention is pung, 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 uh, pair. 3BM. We're gonna draw flower. Don't need it. Don't need it. We're gonna draw eight bam. Oh, how funny. Six eight came in, but this hand is really close. I'd stick with it. Eight bam. This is concealed. Seven dot. We threw it away. Okay, drawing, flower, we don't need it. Drawing for player two, two dot. Drawing for player one, eight, bam, again. Oh well. Drawing for player two, eight, bam. Oh yes, wow. Nine, nine, eight, nine, eight, seven, nine, eight, seven. We need a seven crack or a nine dot to get ready on a pair hand. We're gonna throw away the red dragon. Seven bam. They're not ready. Oh, they don't, they don't really need it though yet. We're, we're still one away up there. Seven dot again. Oh shoot, that would have come in. Flower. Drawing for player two. Seven bam. Oh my goodness, they're ready to win here. We're gonna discard that white dragon. Ready to win on a nine dot, ready to win on a six crack, two pair hands. We just got through the third wall. We're heading into the end game now. This is when you should decide to push to win or switch to defense. Ready to win, one away from ready. They should push to win, ready to win two discards, including joker bait. I'd push for both. Drawing for player one, red. Player two, four, bam. Player one, seven, crack. Seven crack. Oh, this hand's not ready. Oh, wait. Yeah, they are. Nine, eight, seven. Nine, nine, eight. Nine, eight, seven. Nine, eight, seven. They're ready on a nine dot. Up here. One crack. Down here. Nine crack. Three dot. Six bam. Nope, we're sticking with dots. One bam. Ah, they keep getting flowers. Oh, six dot. Nope. Pong, pong. Yeah, they're still too far away. South. Where's that six crack? Five crack. Four 
four band. Four crack. Two dot. They got the two dot. Six bam. Pung, pung, pung. They're ready here on an eight dot. They're ready here on a six crack. West. I'm kind of surprised. Joker. Six bam. Ready on a double mahjong. That's that's a mahjong right there. We're ready on a six crack for double mahjong. Let's keep going just for a minute here. Five dot. I want to see if we can draw that six crack. Oh, two crack. Oh my goodness. Here we go. Oh, six crack. The white was thrown. Let's throw the white. This is going to go down here. Nine dot. Discard. Nine dot. We're going to mahjong. So we're going to win on the pair hand here. I'm going to put it in the back. So they got a pair hand, 998 pair hand. They're going to discard the six crack. And they're ready to win on a quint with a three crack. But we're going to double mahjong right here. Double mahjong. Flower, two, four, six, eight, two, two. Two, four, six, eight pairs. They won. Focused on all evens. Isn't that something? I am really surprised. Up here, nine, nine, eight pair hand and ready on a quint. Very interesting. So for payment, they would get double for each. That was kind of exciting, actually. I'm really surprised that that second evens hand came in. Very interesting. I am going to work on this theory. I'll let you know how it goes. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table between now and the next solitaire for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. May all your picks be keepers.